Hey guys, today we're going to talk about the relationship between hair loss and digestion. Okay, uh, one of the key nutrients for hair health and growing hair is biotin. It's one of the B vitamins. Okay, it's an essential cofactor or helper factor for enzymes that help you make proteins from amino acids. So it's needed to make hair. Okay, and your microbes in your gut also make B vitamins, including biotin. But when you're exposed to antibiotics, you decrease the amount of friendly bacteria, thereby lessening the production of biotin. But not only that, you have an increase of growth of another microbe that can't make biotin. Okay, it's called Lactobacillus marinus. I'm going to put a link down below. So you have the situation where you have this microbial imbalance in your gut that just can't make enough biotin. Now, there's a couple things that you have to realize. You might say, well, I don't take antibiotics, right? I haven't taken an antibiotic for years. Well, I just did a video on this. I'll put a link down below. GMO food has residue of glyphosate, okay? So in 2010, Monsanto got the patents for glyphosate being an antibiotic, okay? I mean, this is like all over the place. Like it's in the water supply, it's in the food supply, uh, in vegetables, uh, it's in the feed that are fed the livestock. Uh, it's in a ton of foods in the soy oil, the corn oil. Here's just another link that I want to bring your awareness up that your hair loss could be coming from your digestive system. So in which case I would highly recommend finding a good probiotic to start building up this flora and also take a product that has biotin in it. And I put a link down below of a good source that I recommend. All right. Thanks for watching. Hey guys. So there's a whole bunch of people that really need this information. So press the share button and let's get it way out there.